Okay, good day everyone. Today I want to share is AMPR camera. Okay, so this is a TCT 205E with the AMPR camera which is able to capture number plate. So as you see here, they usually majorly on install on the AMPR side. So currently I want to show that this AMPR is able compatible with those AM, uh, AMPR as well. So these camera are able to capture the number plate and send the metadata to the uh, AMPR and also the HCP but I uh, here I don't uh, don't use HCP so I just use AMPR with those uh, M uh, AMPR with those M MVR only so I got one brand, one model over here the S7716 these 7716 NXI K4 are able to support AMPR OS over here under the specifications so this is how we select our model lah. So because uh, you have to careful selecting your model, maybe you are you select the model but you're not able to have that functions. So I hope all here are able to get your item properly and cut your project and use it wisely. Okay? So this is how we able to select our model. Okay, so now I want to show how we going to activate the camera i already power up all the camera and also done the some wiring so over here as you see i have an sadp over here so i take a look okay so firstly we have to activate our camera first so we activate our camera first so as usual we we activate the camera so we put the ip address okay Okay, done the activation, so we call inside. Okay, so make sure you are running under run as reload under Internet Explorer because we can run the full functions. Okay, so we going to create the admin and the password. Okay, so the camera, once you log in ready, they have uh, your image over here. I have uh, done the MPA, the video footage over here to show the camera. Okay, so firstly, we have to done the quick configuration first. Okay, over the quick configuration, of course, we have to depends. But for my case, I using video detections, entry and exit, and also control by cameras because I don't use HCP. If you are using HCP, yes, you need to click by platform. So currently, I buy camera. So over here, they have uh, some setting. For example, you want to under the allow list. Yes, you have to trigger this as an open. Okay, so we next on it. Okay, so over here on this under here we have to draw the line properly. So we can draw like that. Okay, because as long you like a car coming in, so as long as my slide are doing like that. Okay, I have a car coming in. So the trigger point we have to, to put center because uh, once you have to put on the center the web the car coming the time as you will trigger lah. Okay. So over here we click complete. Okay, done. So now we take a try first over the live view. So we pick put arming. Okay, we wait for the next page. That's car coming in. So they able to detect the plate number over here, like here lah. So it's okay already. So we back on the our configuration part. So I want to show that uh, how we going to do the allow list over here. <coughs> so we going to the capture. They have an entry and exit. The entry and exit ready. You just double check your your here. Okay, so you make sure your allow list are under open gate. Okay, so we're back to the allow list and block list. So in this part, where are you going to add? So it's very easy, you click the import. So you download the template first. I can save on it. Okay, we, we, open, we open the folder. Okay, we take the allow list. Okay. So he mentioned over here they have a nice plate and also the allow list of plate block, uh, block list. So I have here I put KFC 
I have to enable the, this Excel file. I put the KFC because this is one of the, the list. And also I put UKM9999. 9999. Okay, so this also under my allow list. So time being, you just copy paste ah, because there is under 2023 is quite long. So we save on it. Okay, so done ready. This under allow list, block list, tablet, EM1. So we close on it. So we back over here, we browse the information. Come to the back box. We go to the, allow, the, the download allow list, EM block 1. Okay, open it. Then we click import. So importing the file. Click OK. So you can see I have a license plate over here. We should under allow list. So we are nothing to do over here. Okay, we nothing to do over here. We're back to our live view. Okay, so we put our arming here. So that's why we have no. Okay, so I have uh, put an MPR camera like here. So I have made a sensor over here. So when he recognized the the number plate here, we have uh, open. Okay, as you see, he already recognized the UKM nine nine nine. The the door is open. We wait another one more time for the KFC fifty. And also you can see the number plate are already re are already viewing over right here already. So as you see they see the KFC fifty they will trigger the uh, number plate. Okay, the trigger the door door sensor. Okay, so this is how we doing for the allow list. Okay, so this is the time we have to activate our MVR. So how are we going to activate our MVR? Sam, you go into the SATP, you take the MVR, you we activate it. By, by, by using the, the key in the uh, password. Uh. Okay, so we activate it. So cancel it. Okay, do us do the same things. Uh. Okay, after we activate the cam the MVR, we have to make sure the DACP is turning off because this is a system. So you make sure you key in your ID, your password, and your password I have to key in one more time to modify the setting. Okay, so this is how we're going to the change change the DACP to be a static. Okay, so we follow Okay. Mm. Okay, so after we activate it, we try to key in the password over here. Okay. So going to the camera management. Okay, as you see they have an auto mode. So we delete it and do a quick add again. So it will detect the camera. Okay, we we'll add into it. So the camera already preview on the MVR side. So there is a vehicle detection we have to do. So make sure vehicle detections. We enable it. And in case session have to notify surveillance center. Okay, so we save on it. So that's all for those configuration between camera and also NVR. So later I will show you how the how the operation of the live view doing uh, during the NVR. Okay. Okay, as usual and the NVR side, I want to show how the things how operating. Okay, so we over here just click apply. So for this I don't show. Okay, so I can on it. So because this I done ready, so you just click uh, somewhere else. They will pass the thing to finish. Okay. So if you want to enable auto login, this up to you. You just click yes. Okay. So done ready over here. 
you just right click menu okay they ask you for the key in the user and the password uh, so we key in the password of the MDR so log in so better I say okay so this is a configuration part so you can see our target detections we click the on the vehicle side Okay, as you see, they are able to detect the vehicle already. So we go into the configuration. We just make sure everything is done. The camera is done connection ready, and uh, they have a uh, events. I think not much to do over here. So we take a search. How we search the number plate? So very easy. We just example. I have a vehicle here over here. We just click the vehicle on the first camera. So you can search the number plate. So they will come out all the number plate coming out. Okay. So example, I want to search the only UKM nine 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 nine. So I'm going to do is just going back to over here vehicle. You just type your UKM nine 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 nine. Okay. So we just click search. So all the UKM nine nine we preview on the image. So this is how the NPR work on the NBR. So uh, what I'm going to tell you is this NPR system is only able to read and read and view the M uh, detected uh, license plate number. It's not able to control the uh, the NPR. So for the allow list, yes, you still need using HCP to control the and PR camera to trigger open or close of the barricade but we still able to using the direct camera to do the allow list to let the barrier open uh, so over here we have a limitation but as long as this can I put, this can do for a small project I hope can help you all guys okay uh, please like subscribe to my channel